Good morning. Today we're here at Kroger. We're going to go in and check out some of the sales prices for the week. Some of the things you guys have asked about and check the shelves. Let's get to it. Okay, as soon as we come into Kroger here, we have just a few days before Christmas. They do still have their Kroger Spiral Hams on sale for 89 cents a pound. Regular price on these is $3.49 a pound. Don't know how long this deal is going to last. Probably just this week. So, um, it doesn't say on here, but you do have to spend an extra $25 to get that deal. I am at a smaller Kroger today. Thought we'd go to a different one here. Just see if they had any other options. But they do have the Cook's Ham Portions uh, hams here. 79 cents a pound. This is also one where you have to spend an extra $25. It doesn't say that on here, but it does in the ad. Yeah, so you can only get one with your Kroger Plus card. Bone in, limit one with additional $25 purchase. And it does say the Cook's Ham on there too. Uh, and it does say the extra $25 purchase. They do not have the signs out here, but we knew that that's what it was. I, I don't know. They just hadn't put it out yet, I guess. They do have the 80% lean three-pound tubes on sale for $8.97 this week. That brings it down to $2.99 a pound. They do have Tyson drums, wings, or thighs. Buy one, get one free this week. BOGO alert. They also have these ribeyes here. And the, you have to buy the value pack here, but it is $9.99 a pound. Also, they don't have any here at this Kroger, but they do have the rib roasts on sale this week for $7.99 a pound. Checking my map here. Yes, it does say $7.99 a pound. It does say limit one with additional $25 purchase. So this is another item you have to spend $25 on to get this sale. Cycling back up to the front here to check some of the produce. They have these Kroger tricolor peppers for $3.99. That is up from $3.49 and they put low price on here. It's kind of funny. They raise it 50, 50 cents and call that a low price. Usually when we see low price, that means it's going up again. So take that for what you will. I don't know. These just seem to keep going up everywhere. They do have a digital coupon on the Campari tomatoes. $2.49 down from $3.49. Also, I wanted to mention that a lot of the same, pretty much all of the same digital coupons that we saw last week are going to apply to this week. You can use up to five times. Uh, we'll go over some of them. I just noticed mushrooms went up here. Uh, these uh, whole mushrooms here, the Kroger, were $2.29. They went up to $2.39. Uh, and they've been low in a lot of different Krogers. And that could be why they were raising prices. I really don't that, that could be why. Uh, the sliced ones are still $2.49, but I don't know. Usually when these go up in price, these will too. I wouldn't be surprised if we see these at $2.59. I usually just get the whole ones anyway and cut them up myself. We had a couple comments on mushrooms over the last few days, so wanted to point this one out. Uh, $2.08 at Walmart. They do still have their five-pound bag of russet potatoes on sale for 99 cents. 99 cents on the digital coupon. You can use up to five times. Get 25 pounds of potatoes for $5 if you want this week. They do have a sale on blueberries. Two for $5. You do not have to buy two with this. Um, this is one pint for $2.50. And they do have cherries back in. We've been getting some comments on sweet cherries. I haven't been able to find any. They do have some at Kroger. They are $4.99 a bag right now. Regular price, $5.99. So a dollar off this week. They do have pineapples for 97 cents still this week. 97 cents, that's a good deal, especially for Chiquita. Uh, their clementines, mandarins here, are $3.99. We saw these were $2.49 at Meyer, so a lot cheaper. They do have their Cosmic Crisp apples, Autumn Glory apples. I haven't seen those in a long time. Envy apples. Uh, Envy Apples, $1.79 a pound, 89 cents a pound for the Autumn Glory. Cosmic Crisp, so surprisingly, 99 cents a pound. That's a great deal. They do have the Honey Crisp uh, for $1.99 a pound. And we did go over last week how the Gala, Granny Smith, and Fuji Apples did go up to $1.79 a pound. But good to see a few sales at least. I never thought I'd say this, but we're seeing bags of lemons go so high in price. Unless you plan on using a lot of lemons... It might be wise to just get one for 79 cents. I mean, these are bigger than the ones you're gonna get in a bag. And 
we've been seeing like two pound bags going for four or five sometimes 549 like I just feel like I could get three or four of these and it would last me a while but if you're someone that uses lemon for everything it may be a better deal but I don't know lemon's really been skyrocketing in price lately I'm kind of surprised to see these for 79 cents a piece still this is probably something I would take a picture of just to make sure they give it to me for that price one thing I did expect to see on sale this week is sweet potatoes a few days before Christmas here 89 cents a pound still I don't know, no deals here are really sticking out to me except for the ham. Um, guys, I have a feeling that the prices are going to be going up on some of this stuff here after the first of the year. So if you're looking for some of these rice and dry beans like jasmine rice and stuff, I don't know. I would recommend buying up one or two when you find a good deal on it because these kind of things we're constantly seeing go up in price now. And um, got a little bit of a sale on some of them here, $1.50 for a pound of, oh, two pounds. Okay, that ain't bad. Two pounds for the brown rice there, and the long grain white rice, uh, two pounds for a dollar fifty. So okay, a little bit of a deal there, uh, but yeah, we are starting to see uh, it go up in price, and we've been getting a lot of comments that you haven't been able to find a lot of different ones. Um, Kroger seems to have a pretty good variety, especially at the smaller Kroger here. We also had somebody comment on rice aroni. Um, we seem to have plenty. I know you were saying how you, it's been hard to find. We do see less variety of it. One thing I will say is it is getting more expensive. It's been three for four dollars here for a while, but we've seen these as high as a dollar forty-nine, dollar fifty-nine a box at some places. So if that's something you like, even at three for four dollars, I would buy some up before the prices go up again. And if you are one of the thousand viewers that have asked about Ben's original ready rice over the last year, now is the time to buy a dollar fifty a bag. Dollar fifty, that's the best price I've probably ever seen on it. Well, at least for years. Um, two fifty nine is gonna be the regular price. That's gone up from two forty nine, dollar fifty a bag. You can use this up to five times on the digital coupon. Now's the time. I know we get a lot of comments on Cremet Pasta. I was just passing through, past all the rice and everything, so they have it on sale for $1.25. You do not have to buy four on this sale. You can just buy one as long as you use your Kroger Plus card. $1.25 a box, better than $1.50. Cremet is actually cheaper than Kroger now, uh, at least while it's on sale. $1.34 a box for the Kroger brand. So, And somebody was asking about the Barilla Ready Pastas. They do have them back in here. I remember the last time at this particular Kroger, they were out of them. We did see them at the marketplace the other day. They are still $2.49 a bag, um, but it is a lot lower. They don't they don't have many of them. A few days before Christmas, I, I thought maybe that we would find a sale on the cream of mushroom or cream of chicken. It's on a little bit of a sale, $1.25 a can, but come on. Like, these were $0.89 cents a can on a digital coupon before Thanksgiving. Why is that not going on now? A few days before Christmas. If you want cream of celery too, you're going to pay full price. $1.89 a can is ridiculous. I do have a little bit of a sale on the four pack cans of tomato and chicken noodle for $4.49. Still making them more than a dollar a piece, but I don't know. This this right here, I'm, I, that's why I wanted to check this. I was like, maybe we can find it cheaper. Um, it has been going up everywhere, and we have not, anywhere that's been a sale, Meyer anywhere, we haven't seen the cream of celery on sale anywhere, so there must be something with that. I don't really know, but I'm not paying $1.89 a can. Um, they probably want you to try and buy the Kroger brand here. I mean, if I was going to do that, I would go to Aldi or Meyer, um, and these are a dollar a can. These are a dollar a can, so yeah, cheaper, and you know, the cream of celery, oh, some of them aren't though. Okay, so the chicken with rice, okay, so four for five, but the cream of soups are a dollar a can of the Kroger, and they do have the cream of celery, which is actually a dollar twenty-five a can. That went up, dollar twenty-five a can for the cream of celery Kroger brand. Wow. Looks like the Progresso Soup and Campbell's Chunky, no sales on these this week. Two forty-nine a can for both, two fifty, penny, penny more on the Chunky, Campbell's Chunky than the Progresso been getting a lot of comments on ramen noodles lately um and as you see these have gone up to two dollars a pack now two for four two dollars they were three for five so you know it just keeps going up they make it look like you're getting a sale here two for four and with this you do not have to buy two though most stores you do kroger you do not as long as you use your kroger plus card or if it says two or more um 
than you would have to. But yeah, it's definitely low. We've been getting a lot of comments lately that ramen's been low. A lot of the boxes anyway. They got plenty of the six packs. You know, they're getting more expensive. People are becoming more aware of the prices, and I like seeing that. That's it's good that people are realizing that no, you're spending more here. That being said, though, they could have just filled this. I really don't know. But from what I see and from what we hear on the channel here, uh, shoppers are definitely becoming smarter. And look at this. That's what I mentioned yesterday for the big uh, 12 packs of them here. $3.79 here at Kroger. $3.29 at Walmart. Looks like they're trying to sneak in a regular price rise here on Del Monte while they're still selling them for a dollar which this deal doesn't expire until January 3rd, 2023. Now, this doesn't include all of them. This only includes corn, green beans, and I do believe peas. They don't have all the signs up here on this, um, but I do know that's what it includes. Well, I don't know. I don't see it on the peas anymore. They don't have the the sale on the peas. It says $1.59 a can. These were $1.49 last week, regular price. That's why I checked the regular prices so we know what it's going to be. Um, yeah, I don't know. I don't know if the peas are on it or not. So this is like what I was talking about. They do have where you can buy, like where it says final cost when you buy two. If it says that, then you have to buy two. Uh, this one particular is for the Ritz Crackers. $2.49 a box on sale um, yeah so you would have to get two of them to get that sale okay so the canned fruits are still on sale with the Del Monte I was curious about that three for five dollars this week the sale ends uh, December 27th so that will be Tuesday a couple days after Christmas there three for five dollars you do not have to buy three they are a dollar sixty seven each uh, regular price is two forty nine on these, but something I mentioned last week, we noticed that the Kroger brand went up. These were $1.39 on most of them. Now, they throw in a sale here, $1.50 a can, but that's what the regular price is going to be. This is up $0.20 cents a can. So we had said yesterday at Walmart, they had these Eagle brand condensed milks here for two fifty dollars a can, two forty eight. dollars because um, somebody left a comment saying that they had thought that their sale on these were two for five at Kroger. No, not well, at least not at ours. They are three dollars a can, regular price three twenty nine. So only gonna save thirty cents. It's crazy. Also, looks like evaporated milk went up here. This was on a dollar seventy nine there for a while. Looks like it's gonna be two dollars. It's gone up too. Look at this, two nineteen, regular price now. On the brighter side of things, it does look like they got plenty of sugar in. They have their four pound sugar smidgen spoon version, 289 for four pounds, but they've got Domino sugar here on a digital coupon. They actually have some in this week, 399. 399, you can get it for what the regular price was a couple months ago. Uh, 10 pound sugar here. It doesn't have a price on here. They took it down, so I don't know if it went up or not, but it was 999, which was the better deal. Now they do have their 25 pound bag for $17.98. That is ridiculous of their cheaper sugar. $13.98 for the 25 pound, a great value at Walmart. So way cheaper there than here. I can't believe that's 18 bucks. They are usually pretty well stocked on flour at this Kroger and they have some sales on the King Arthur. They got the organic all purpose flour, which we got some comments on for $8.99 down from $10.49. All purpose flour, uh, just the regular um, $4.49 on sale down from $5.99. But, you know, we've seen these prices kind of go up and down. Like the whole wheat flour for $6.49. All of these were $6.49 for a while. We saw the regular price drop some. They do have the Pillsbury on a digital coupon for the £5. $3.79 for that one. They still have the gold metal all-purpose flour bleached and unbleached for $3.99 this week. These have gone up to $4.49 regular price here. Okay, so one of the big things I wanted to talk about is that if you are having trouble finding spices, you may want to check like one of your neighborhood. This is more of a neighborhood Kroger. It's a lot smaller than the other Kroger's that we usually shop at or the Marketplace. Uh, marketplace is huge and they always seem to have a lot more spices here because not as many people shop at this Kroger's as the other one, so that does help. But yeah, they have a lot of, they've got the uh, seasonal salt somebody asked about on sale for $2 this week. That's good. Um, yeah, they just, they have a lot more. It's well, 
better packed, well organized because, yeah, it's, I just don't think they sell as much here. But good to see y'all. Look at this. Ooh, buy two, get one free of these Kroger brands here. These things have gotten pretty expensive. But to get one, buy two, get one free, that pretty much covers all of them. Fully loaded on cooking oil. The Kroger brand is still $3.99 for the canola. And they ripped the sticker off of the vegetable. This was $3.79. I don't know. It may have gone up. But uh, yeah, $3.79. Okay. $3.79. It says low price on it though. So that may be going up soon. They do have uh, the Crisco canola and vegetable oil. Two for $5. Making these $5 a piece. Now, if you're not brand particular, they do have the all-vegetable shortening of the Kroger brand on a digital coupon this week for $6.09. You can use up this up to five times. Uh, it is the 48 ounces regular price on this now, $8.49. This was like $4.99 last year, maybe a little over a year, but I remember when this was $4.99. $8.49 now, crazy. Digital coupon this week for $6.09. So we have a few digital coupons on some of the General Mills products here of cereal. Uh, bringing these down to $1.99 on the digital coupon. Um, yeah, and there's quite a few. We've got Captain Crunch on here. Uh, you see what some of these regular prices are going up to. A regular size box of Frosted Flakes, $4.19. $4.19, that is just crazy. Uh, they do have like checks. Looks like pretty much all General Mills. Um, yeah, all these are $1.99 a box, guys. I have a feeling this is going to be another item that goes up after the new year. So if you find some cereal you like, find a good deal on it, buy up a few of them so that you can get it for a decent price before these go up again. That does include Cheerios and Honey Nut Cheerios, $1.99 a box on the digital coupon. Been getting a lot of comments on tea lately. Uh, some people have been saying they haven't been able to find a lot of it. You know, we keep running into this problem with tea. It seems like every few months it goes away. We get a lot of comments, and eventually it just starts coming back. I don't know. Could be a shortage of something. I know the big one seems to be Bigelow tea. That's why I always point it out. Of course, it went up in price. It is three ninety nine. Three twenty nine was the regular price for this, but they were having it on sale for two ninety nine forever. Now, $3.29 is a sale, but that is going to be the regular price when it's all said and done. They do have the green tea. Get some of the elderberry. Somebody was asking about that one. I haven't seen that around, and I have not seen blackberry tea anywhere. I see black tea, but not blackberry. Um, yeah, they do. Okay, got some digital coupons here on Lipton here this week. Uh, wow, purple acai blueberry. Okay, blueberry tea. $1.99, down from $3.59, $1.99 on the digital coupon, good deal there, and they have some of the Zazo teas on sale too for seven, you do not have to buy two with this deal though, $3.50, um, you can mix and match, they do have the Earl Grey, uh, again, no Blackberry, um, do have the Twinnings tea, Twinnings, however you like to say it, Twinnings tea there on sale, a little bit of a sale, good to see it's even coming in. And on to at least my favorite part of the video here, the coffee sales, $6.99 on the digital coupon this week at Kroger. That does not include the Folgers decaf, though. Um, we saw at Meyer it was $7.99 for the Folgers decaf, which was included. So if you have a Meyer and you drink the decaf Folgers here, I'm glad to see that it's coming in. We've been hearing a lot of people say that they haven't been able to find the decaf again. This is another item that we see kind of leave and come back because um, we saw we couldn't find it there for a while. But yeah, uh, Folgers Colombian, uh, different varieties here, $6.99 on digital coupon, you use up to five times. Coffee's going to be going up in price. I, I can't say that for a fact, but I know, I just know, seeing how things have been going, I just know it's going to be going up in price again. So you may want to stock up a little bit. Also, we have a storm coming up, big storm. Don't know if I'm going to be able to make it to Kroger Marketplace on Friday. Um, it's going to be really cold and we're supposed to get some snow. So I uh, may not may do a video at home or something, maybe going over some sales or something like that. But this is one I wanted to point out here because we have about another day here before the storm. You want to make sure you're stocked up on that coffee in case you get uh, trapped inside. Terrible price on Kroger coffee for $8.99. I know some people like it, but it's just, it's getting way too expensive for me. 
no sale on Maxwell House, but they do have the McCafe here, 1349 down from 1599. This deal expires the day after Christmas, so this will expire on Monday. That's weird. Usually this will go through until the Tuesday. I don't know. Well, you really got to look at everything these days. They do have Dunkin' on digital coupon also for the ground coffee, $6.99 for the 12 ounce bags of it here. It is kind of sad that right before Christmas, all the sales are pretty much digital, guys. So, you, you know, it's if you want to get these deals, you're going to have to kind of lock yourself down to your computer. As we always say, we recommend doing it at home, getting on your computer, clipping all the coupons digitally so that you're not in the store trying to scan all these QR codes, which can be troublesome sometimes. $7.99 for the Pete's One Pete's Coffee that I see here, uh, ground coffee, probably the most popular one here. And the Starbucks, uh, $7.99 on the digital coupon. Surprisingly, they have removed the digital coupon from the Green Mountain products and the donut shop. Still on sale. But so far, this is... I. Why is this not stayed on the digital coupons with everything else? I guess maybe it was just for a week. These were $4.99, which was a good deal. But they took that away from us here a few days before Christmas. I don't know. Um, $7.99 on sale. Uh, they have the pods here, which are actually uh, 50 cents cheaper than the ground coffee on the Dunkin' here. $7.49 on the digital coupon. I always like to say use up to five times just because, you know, it's a, it's a good price for you. You know, it's a good time to stock up before things go up again. So we had a comment that Lance Crackers had gone up in price. You're right, they did here too. They were $3.99. $3.99 the last time I checked. $4.29 now. Like these are the cheap of the cheap crackers and they're not cheap anymore. $4.29 for one box. One box. That is crazy. Did want to point out they have the Glad garbage bags on sale here at Kroger. Well, at least the smaller Force Flex ones. These are $11.79 now. Eleven seventy nine digital coupon for eight forty nine, right? That makes it not bad. That's I mean that's a pretty decent deal. But let me say here, if you have a Sam's Club membership, those Power Flex garbage bags you get two hundred of them for eighteen dollars. We saw where the price had actually dropped um, at our Sam's Club. Uh, two hundred of them, they're just as strong as these. I haven't had one rip on me. I mean, two hundred garbage bags for eighteen dollars. It's kind of a no-brainer. If you have, if you, even if you don't have a Sam's Club membership. You know, take notes of these things, and when you have a friend go, go with them. Go with them and just give them the cash. Maybe buy them at lunch. You can buy a piece of pizza and um, a drink there for like $2. So buy them lunch for 2 bucks and get you some uh, good deals. <laughs> I did just find a good deal here on the Pearl Milling Company. We've had a couple comments. You know, we saw where this was gone there for a while. Uh, it has come back in. It's, it's been back for a little while, but it's on a digital coupon. Uh, for the pancake mixes here, buttermilk and the original, $1.99 a box. Regular price on this now is $3.49. $2.99 used to be the price, but it's gone up to $3.49. $1.99 on the digital coupon. Eggs just keep going up in price here, guys. I $5.69 now for 18 count. They were $5.09 last week. Uh, a few days before Christmas, decided to shoot up the prices. Uh, $3.79 now for the 12 count. These were $3.39 last week, so... Right before Christmas. I don't know. It's crazy. Is butter not on sale anymore? It's $5 now. It was $2.99 on the digital coupon last week. I would have thought this would have carried over. I, I checked the ad here just to make sure. And I did not find it for $2.99 in the digital coupon list. So, I don't know. Um, $4.99. Boy, I hope people bought it up. So the Pillsbury Grands are on sale, two for six. That does include the crescent rolls and um, cinnamon rolls, stuff like that. So basically you get them for $3 a can, 29 cents cheaper a can. Now at Meyer, I figured it out, it's going to be like $6.30. But you get three cans. So it's pretty close, you know, a little over $2 a can. So best deals at Meyer right now. Um, but if you just want one, you know, and if you don't want to go to another store, I, I completely understand, you know, uh, the store is pretty crazy right now, a couple days before Christmas, but yeah, better deal at Meyer on the Pillsbury. So I'm surprised to see the digital deals that they've taken away this week. However, they did add a good one on the sliced cheese of the Kroger brand here. $1.79, you can use up to five times. Sargento, look at this. 
Regular price, $4.99 now. These were $3.99. $3.99. So they've gone up a dollar. Uh, but they've slapped a buy one, get one free on here. So you can get them for $2.50 a pack. Now they have the sliced cheese that is not part of this deal. That these are still $3.99. I don't know, guys. Prices just keep soaring. They do have the Kroger shredded cheese and the Kroger brick cheese for the same price, though. $1.79 a brick. And for the shredded, $1.79 for the 8-ounce packs. Hey, guys. Well, that is all the time I have at Kroger today. Unfortunately, the butter is $4.99. $4.99. The sale is over. The $2.99 digital coupon. No, I looked it up on the app. No digital coupon for it. So I, I don't know. A um, lot of things that were on digital coupons aren't. They've added a couple like the cheese. Good deal on the cheese. $1.79 for the shredded, sliced, and the brick cheese. Let us know down in the comments if you have other deals uh, that you would think that help people that have been asking on the channel. Uh, let us know what kind of deals you're finding at some of maybe your Kroger-owned stores or whatever stores. Comment below. Let us know. Um, yeah, I don't know what the deal is. I, I, I expected to see a lot more sales at Kroger. And the sales that we did see, a few of them that aren't on digital coupons, but most of them are digital coupons. Um, and it does kind of stink that we have to uh, do a little extra work doing all that before Christmas, but take my advice. If you're going to shop at Kroger, make sure you do the digital coupons at home uh, so you're not there trying to scan the QR codes every time you come up on something. It's a lot easier doing all that, checking things off. You know, you, you got to plan these days. You really can't go into the store and expect to save money, a good amount of money, if you don't plan ahead. But guys, thank you so much for watching today. Um, we probably will not I don't know if we're going to be able to go to Kroger Marketplace here in a couple days. Uh, we have a huge storm coming. Make sure you guys stay safe. We have another day here. You guys will be seeing this on Thursday. Uh, so the storm's going to roll in for us Friday morning, Thursday night into Friday morning. So um, if you're anywhere west of Cincinnati, you may get it a little sooner than us. Um, but, yeah, stay safe. Make sure you're prepared. Stock up a little bit on things in case you have to sit inside for a couple days. Uh, we will. I will continue to do a couple videos as we go along. Even if we can't get into the stores, I'll be covering other sales and stuff like that. But, guys, thank you so much for watching today. With all that being said, I am out. And always remember, the adventure is out.